unbeaten Rough Riders pounce on winless Tiger Cats 36-20. Regina Despite losing quarterback Trevor Harris to an injury the Saskatchewan Rough Riders improved to 3-0 with a convincing 36-20 victory over the Hamilton Tiger Cats on Sunday. Hello please click join button to help me get equipments and make more quality videos for you, or you know just to get me a juice. Thanks already. Harris was injured late in the second quarter when tackled by Ticats defensive lineman Nick Usher. Harris walked off the field on his own limping gingerly on his left leg. The 38-year quarterback missed the majority of the 2023 CFL season after suffering a tibial plateau fracture of his right knee in a Week 2 loss to the Calgary Stampeders. Harris returned to the rider's sideline midway through the third quarter. He was wearing a brace on his left knee. He tossed passes on the sideline but the riders decided to stick with backup Shea Patterson for the remainder of the game. With Patterson at the controls and the riders holding an 18-7 lead the riders defense took control of the game. Saskatchewan forced three turnovers in the third quarter with Hamilton quarterback Bo Levi Mitchell losing a fumble on the riders 5-yard line and tossing two interceptions. Jamer Thurman had the first interception returning at 28 yards for a touchdown and Demarcus Fields intercepted Mitchell on the next series. Thurman's touchdown along with a 16-yard field goal from Brett Lothar early in the fourth quarter increased Saskatchewan's lead to 28-7. Hamilton cut the lead to 28-14 with 6.29 remaining when anti-leader scored on a one-yard run. The 70-yard drive was kept alive by three Saskatchewan penalties two for roughing the quarterback and one for pass interference in the end zone. The Riders went up 35-14 when Patterson scored on a one-yard run with 2.43 remaining in the game. Kyandra Smith caught a 28-yard touchdown pass from Mitchell with 2.06 left. The ensuing two-point conversion failed giving the Riders a 36-20 lead. The Riders got off to a fast start when Hamilton's Lawrence Woods fumbled the opening kickoff with Saskatchewan recovering on the Ticats 20-yard line. After a 4-yard pass to Sean Bain Harris hit Sam Emilus on a 14-yard touchdown pass. Emilus slipped making his cut but still managed to make the catch. The Riders increased their lead to 14-0 late in the first quarter when rookie receiver Ajuaju hauled in a 40-yard pass from Harris. It was the first regular season CFL touchdown for Aju. On the final play of the first quarter Lothar connected on a 34-yard field goal to give the Riders a 17-0 lead. Bridges caught a 41-yard touchdown pass from Mitchell late in the second quarter to cut Saskatchewan's lead to 18-7. Tiger Cats, travel to Ottawa next Sunday for a tilt with the Red Blocks, 1-1. Rough Riders, bye week. Next game is July 4 when Riders host the Toronto Argonauts. Bell led the final 64 laps of a race that took over 6 hours to complete. Facing elimination national number 1 seed Tennessee forced a decisive Game 3 in the 2024 Men's College World Series with a 4-1 win over Texas A&M. The burgeoning Fever Sky WNBA rivalry delivered again on Sunday with the Sky overcoming a 15-point deficit to beat the Fever 88-87. Texas A&M is one win away from winning its first NCAA championship in baseball after taking Game 1 of the College World Series Finals over Tennessee. The Yankee slugger will not rise for the 2024 Home Run Derby. The Astros' recent luck with starting pitchers is so bad that even guys called up from the minors are getting hurt. The score with Young at 13 under PAR marks just the 13th sub-60 score in PGA Tour history. Neither of these teams existed the last time an NHL team erased a 3-0 lead in the Stanley Cup Final. Our Frank Schwab counts down his NFL Power Rankings grades each team's offseason solicits fantasy football advice and previews what the 2024 season might have in store for each team.